Two dads who got into a fight turned shooting outside Albuquerque's Highland High School will not be charged. We have learned the DA has no plans to pursue a criminal case against either man. News 13's Madeline Schmidt found out why. That little Mexican that works at Walmart that's always mad dogging me. In April. Gunshots rang out at Highland High School after a feud between two dads in the pickup line just off of school property. Court documents and police lapel video reveal that mean looks between Alex Placencio and Juan Saucedo led to the incident. He passed by my car I, and, I, and he said, what? And I said, what? And then I said, I'm tired of your... A confrontation escalated to Saucedo throwing a punch. Placencio grabbed a baseball bat. Saucedo grabbed a metal pole. Then Saucedo shot Placencio in the hand and thigh. And then he just stood there. He had no choice but to shoot me because he would have got whooped. You cannot get away with that. You will be charged with a felony crime. At the time, Albuquerque police seemed certain that both men would face the consequences. There's a dueling charge. It's rarely used. A dueling charge, felony public affray, meaning that when you get involved in a fight, on the public streets and you bring weapons involved, it kicks it up to a felony level. But we've learned that District Attorney Raul Torres's office has decided not to file any charges in the case. APD says it investigated the beat down term shooting and handed over all the facts to the DA. Both men did not want to pursue charges against each other. But what about that felony charge referenced by police? Or the individual that brought the gun to campus, not on the campus, but in the area, will be charged with bringing a gun in the area of a campus. Or maybe child endangerment. The incident set the school into lockdown. The district attorney spokesperson sent us this statement saying both men were culpable but had valid self defense claims and that the DA's office declined to file any other charges. Madeline Schmidt, KRQE News 13. Each father has a restraining order against the other, so they have to pick up their kids on opposite sides of the school.